We saw a lot of plastics here, uh, those plastics that come the river and go to the sea. Nobody catches. Every river leads to an ocean and all oceans are connected. So what might flow here out to sea can end up somewhere around the world. Project Malsum is a project with 14 partners. It's led by CNR. It's the biggest project uh, funded by the European Union to stop plastic pollution in the ocean. We're standing right next to the Rio Ave here in uh, Portugal, in the city of uh, Vila do Conde. And uh, we're about to install our new bubble barrier. The bubble barrier is an innovative system which uses air bubbles to capture plastic trash in rivers. So we place a perforated tube diagonally on the bottom of the river and then a lot of tiny air bubbles will start rising to the surface and they created an upwards directed water flow and this water flow can lift up plastic that's also underwater and bring it to the surface. With the help of the push of the river it will all get pushed to the side and into our catchment system which is where we then can retain it and then remove it from the water. So the role of the University of Malta and the Malmström project is uh, to provide uh, part of the electricity required by the bubble barrier technology uh, using uh, renewable energy technologies. So one technology which will be installed on a rooftop and another technology using a floating dock. From preliminary estimates, uh, we think that the solar panels will cover at least 25% of the bubble barrier's energy requirements. The river is very important for the local community. Uh, there are the main activities, fisher boats that go every day to fish and come back, and also the sport activities that are performing the river. The biggest advantage of the bubble barrier is that it does not hinder the activities performed in the river. So this bubble barrier is the first internationally we have now systems in the Netherlands that work really well, but what we really want to do is make it accessible globally because our problem that we're facing here is global and the bubble barrier can be used in a lot more places around the world.